it's AJ, and today we're drawing Shuey Ron Ron, the 2022 Paralympic mascot. So let's get started. So for today's drawing, I'm just using a number two pencil again with a eraser because we are going to erase a few construction shapes and a sharpie. You can use whatever you'd like to ink and, you know, draw. And I'm just going to use some markers today. So to start our drawing, we're going to do an oval in the middle of, right about in the middle of our paper. This is going to be our character's head. He has a very bulbous head because his he's supposed to be like a lantern character. So we're going to draw that in the middle of our paper, just like that. And um, remember, you can pause the video if you can't keep up. You know, I'm going to make that just a little bit taller, just like that. There we go. So there's the start of our character's head. There we go. Now, he has this um, little hook on his head because he's a lantern. And to start that, we're going to draw a little line curving on the top of his head. Just like that. There we go. And that's going to extend out a tiny little bit outside of his head. Just like that. And um, he has some snow right on top of that. So we're going to draw that next. So this is going to extend a little farther out than the last line you drew because it's on top of that one. So you're just going to draw like another little um, layer on top of that last one and then add a squiggle line right here. Kind of an S line on top. Now let's add the hook on top of his head. So there's going to be a little bump right up here on top of this snow. And then this hook is going to be coming out of that. So for the hook, you're going to draw a line out here, curve back in, do another curve up. Well, there we go. Another curve up and then back in and do the same thing right there. And then you're going to follow that line on the inside right around like that. And then right in here, you're going to add two little bumps inside of that. So there's his head. Let's start on his body. So for his body, he has this little scarf around his neck. And we're going to start by drawing that. So for that, you're just going to extend a line down from the bottom half of his head. Come around. Just like that. And then connect back into his head on this side right there. And there we go. Now let's draw his body. So to start his body, we're just going to do a curved line, not too big. We don't want him to be too round. And you're just going to curve down to here, just like that, and make a little foot. That's just going to be like a little bump area, a little bump spot right there. So there's his first leg. Now on this side, you're going to do the same thing. Curve around and make another little bump foot. Just like that. And then connect them with sort of a little triangle in the middle. Now let's add his arms. So his right arm is just at his side like this. And it's going to be kind of like a half a teardrop. And that's just going to connect back into his body. For his other arm, he's kind of like waving, so you're just going to do another sort of that teardrop shape, except you're going to extend it a little bit farther, and it's going to go a little bit in front of his face. We are going to erase that line going through it later. So just like that. So there's his arms and his body and his head. Now let's add the details to the scarf, because there's this little part hanging down from his scarf. So for that, you're just going to draw two lines, kind of like an 11, and then you're going to connect them together with sort of like fork lines. 
just like that. So there's his scarf. Now he has the little he has a little logo on his belly. So for that, you're just going to draw a circle right in the middle of his tummy, right above his legs. And then we're going to add this logo right here. So for the logo, you're going to start with at the top of the of the circle going doing a little line down and then you're gonna go out like that this is gonna be kind of a squiggly line and then you're gonna come down again just like that and then come in and at the very bottom go back in just a little bit right there then to represent the words on his belly I'm just gonna add some squiggles right there and then the Paralympic logo which is just three curved lines kind of connected together almost connected together just like that so there's the details on his belly now um, let's start on his face so for his head well for his face it's kind of like a patch of snow on his face so you're going to start with a curved line pretty close to the side of his head, not too close, just kinda. And you're just gonna curve like that, kind of like a C, but not too, um, not too far in. Then you're going to curve down from the bottom of that C, around and up, right to here. And then you're going to, on the top of the C, add another smaller curve, and two more, just like that. And then you're going to dip down from that one a little ways, and then curve back out, and add two more bumps right there. So there's where his face is going to go. So for his cheeks, you're just going to draw a circle, and we are going to fill those in with pink later, just very lightly. He's got rosy cheeks. Now let's add his eyes. His eyes are very simple. They're just kind of um, ovals with a little sparkle inside. And you're going to fill those in with black. They're fairly far apart, like right next to the cheeks on each side. And just add that little sparkle inside. And those will be filled in with black. So there's all the basic details. And he has this little like dove design on his face on his ankles and on this little part on his head. And you can add those if you like, they're a little bit more complicated, um, but I'm just going to kind of add a wavy line right here and add a few details at the bottom. And we're going to fill that in with yellow later because I don't want this to be too complicated. And then on the bottom, you're just gonna do that same thing again. There we go. And the other foot, once again, just like that. So pretty simple. And he has some lines on his face. Those are just going to be very pale. You're not gonna fill those in with black, but you can use a darker red to add them when you're coloring. So there we go. And there is Shui Ron Ron, Paralympic mascot for 2022. Okay. Okay. I have traced Shui Ron Ron. And as you can see, I didn't trace all the lines, like the ones going right through some of the details up here and through his arm, because um, those are not visible. Those were just to um, help guide through the drawing. Now, um, the colors we're going to use today are a bright red. Um, let me find it. There it is. There we go. Are a bright red, a golden yellow color, or uh, yeah, golden yellow color. And uh, that's about it. We're going to use a pink to fill in his cheeks and as you can see I did not trace his cheeks because those are very light I didn't think they needed black around them and I'm using a darker red to um, draw those lines on his 
um, face. So let's do it. Okay, our shoey Ron Ron is done. Now is a good time to pause the video if you would like to match my colors, or you can color it however you want. And you can add whatever you'd like to your character. I hope you all enjoyed this video, and remember to like and subscribe. Bye!